Greetings Internet, it's Katie and I'm back today on your computer screens with a brand new video all about periods. This is another video in my TMI series where I basically just talk about gross things on the internet that we have to deal with as females. In this video, we are just getting real, okay? You know, I'm not a fan of all of those frilly, twirling girls in white dresses on commercials and stuff about periods. You know, periods, they are definitely tricky, but we all experience them as females, and therefore we have to stick together and just take the right precautions to make that time of the month a lot less terrible. So, in today's video, I'm just gonna talk to you guys about periods and my experience with having my period for as many years as I've had it. I think it's been a long time now. I got in, like, seventh grade. So Without further ado, we're just gonna get started with it. I don't really have a list of things I'm gonna talk about. I'm just gonna kind of go with it. So where do I begin? Okay, periods. I got mine when I was about, I don't know, how old are you when you're like in seventh grade? Like 15? No, I feel like it's younger than that. So I got my period actually when my mom was on vacation or something. I don't know what she was doing. And my dad and I were just home by ourselves and I just got my period. And at first, I legitimately thought that I peed my pants. I thought that I peed myself because I felt wetness and I'm like, this is weird. Then, okay, here's what leads me to the really fun part of my whole period situation. Something very unique about me getting my period is I could not use tampons. Uh, for the longest time. Actually, the majority of my life, I have not been able to use tampons until last year. So that sounds crazy to you guys, probably, unless you also experience this as well. But I had this problem um, with my vagina where I couldn't put a tampon in. I don't really know. It's kind of a very basic thing. I just couldn't get it up there. Don't know why. Still don't know why. I went to the gynecologist and I had them help me out with like figuring out everything about my anatomy and stuff and I still could not figure out or I just couldn't do it. Like my body just like rejected it. For the longest time I thought that I was like broken. Like that my vagina was broken and I'm only sharing this. This is like so TMI and so just like it was a very big insecurity of mine for a long time. So I'm really only sharing this with you guys just in case there's someone out there who's experiencing the same thing and just can't use tampons and feels like they're alone you're so not alone after years and years and years of trying and reading books and trying to figure out how to get tampons in I just you know shoved it up there and it happened it went up there and I just felt fine about it I think it was a confidence thing like it was all in my head and I was just like freaking out about it and I just you know my body just closed up because I just felt so I don't even know just like anxious about started it. started with the extra thin kind, the little small ones, extra small, I don't know what those things are called, but they're like really thin, and then I worked my way up, and now I can use super pluses, and I'm totally fine. So that is my little tampon story. I hadn't been able to use them for such a long time, so I got very used to just using pads. I don't like it just like sitting there. I kind of like to have the tampon, and a lot of times I'll double up, and I'll use a tampon and a pad, and so you know, you can save your underwear, which is actually the campaign of one of my favorite brands, U by Kotex. They have this, this campaign called Save the Undies. Their pads and tampons in particular are my absolute favorite, and I do want to show you guys them in the video just so you can see what I've been using, especially since I've had issues in the past with tampons. These are the tampons that I've been using for the longest time, and these are the ones that I actually was able to get inside of me, finally. So I don't know what it is, but I've refused to use any other brand of tampon because I'm like, this works. These are by the brand U by Kotex, and these are the tampon brand. Versions. Um, but they also have pads, which I absolutely adore. And these ones, the ones that come in this package, this is one of my unopened ones, um, they're the U by Kotex Regular Security Ultra Thin Pads. And they come with 22 in here, which is quite a few, especially because my period tends to last a long time, so you have plenty in here. My system for pads and tampons lately has been, I will put a tampon in, which these are them, right here, yeah. So these are what the tampons look like. You guys probably know what a tampon looks like. Hopefully you guys do. If you don't, then um, should I show you? I guess I will. This is not gonna be like a beginners to tampons video. I'm sure there's plenty of those on the internet, but you know, this is what the U by Kotex tampon looks like, pretty basic, and then you just, should I do it? I've never done this, oh my gosh, like not in my, you know. Oh, there we go, there it is. And this goes up there, whoops, we're down, it goes up there. And that's just the other part. And then for my very heavy flow days, which are quite frequent, I am one of the many girls in the world that experiences very heavy flow. And a wide set vagina. If you don't know that movie reference, we can't be friends, sorry. <laughs> so on my heavy flow days, when I put a tampon in, I always ensure that I don't ruin my underwear by using a U by Kotex Security Ultra Thin pad on my underwear, just to ensure that I don't ruin my underwear, just in case 
I, you know, I just bleed through my tampon because that happens all too often, trust me. Guys, let's be real, underwear is not cheap, okay? I'm always amazed by how expensive underwear is. At like, even Target it's expensive. So we as females need to take a pledge to use pads and save the undies. It's such a big deal. It's a cause that I will stand for, okay? These ones are great because they're ultra thin. I feel like sometimes when I have a really thick pad in my underwear, I kind of have to like waddle to walk with it because it feels like I'm wearing a diaper or something. I don't know if that's like so TMI, but then again, this is also a TMI video, so I guess I can say that. They also feature a 3D capture core, which locks away wetness to help stop leaking, so you won't have to worry about getting all over your precious underwear from Victoria's Secret that you probably spent half of your paycheck on because, let's be real, those little bedazzly things that they put on there, that's, they're expensive, okay? That is Victoria's Secret, okay? If any guy wants to know the secret of Victoria's Secret, like $30 underwear. What is this? Guys, we got to save the undies. We have to stop those senseless leaks. We have to be smart, okay? So invest in some of these pads along with the tampons. They are wonderful. Also be sure to visit the UBI Kotex website to check these out for yourself. I will have the links in the description box below so you guys can check those out. Some other fun little tidbits of information I'm going to throw at you about that time of the month. Sitting in tech ed class next to my friend Bradley, who you guys probably know from this channel, quite a lot. He was sitting next to me in this class and I literally was in tears. I was crying because my cramps were so bad. We were watching this video in technology class. I have some tips regarding getting rid of cramps and stuff like that or just easing them. I definitely recommend investing in a heating pad. Mine is actually in my box downstairs for my college box because I haven't had that bad of cramps this summer. I don't know if that's like a summer thing or something but it hasn't been as bad. So I have that and I use that on my stomach. It's so so nice. It works wonders. Also if you have like a pet, an animal, just have your dog like sit on your lap or something. Whenever I get bad cramps I Google like period cramp like fetal position or something like that. There's like a certain position you guys can do. I'll link it below. That eases the feeling of your cramps and it's just like this one position you kind of get in with your knees locked up against you and it works so well. It sounds dumb but it works so well. And then obviously just making yourself some tea is also great. I love green tea and just anything warm that will fill your body with warmth helps because warmth helps get rid of the cramps. Even the most like hashtag girl boss people in the world get periods like Michelle Obama and Beyonce and who else is great um like JK Rowling she's pretty great she wrote Harry Potter which is my childhood so she gets periods too okay if she can get periods and write all those books and take care of like four boys or how many kids she has I think you and I can get through this so that my friends was my video all about periods hope you guys all enjoyed it and definitely check out the links in the description box below all about how you can save your undies that was my video hope you guys enjoyed all of my weird analogies and everything that I just talked about my biggest tip don't be grossed out or ashamed by your own anatomy you know periods some people would say that they suck but they also prove that we are women and we are powerful. So definitely leave me some fun comments below and I'll talk to you guys all in my next video. Bye.